I cannot wait for this to be over so I can go back to being a normal, anonymous lawyer who also happens to be a Hulk. What are you talking about? Jen, the genie is out of the bottle, girl. You are a story now. <laughs> well, you know, there are many female perspectives um, baked into this story. There were certain things that felt very universal to all the women involved in production. There is so much information to be gleaned from the female perspective in it. And from the way that Jen experiences her Hulkness, I think we can relate to that in, in so many ways. It's very real, which was always the goal. Like, it, it makes me so happy. There are so many moments in the show where they immediately thought, oh, a woman definitely wrote this. Now tell us, what's it like being a female lawyer? Twice the work, half the recognition, and you're constantly being asked what it's like being a female lawyer. You know, we actually get into her conflict with people uh, not necessarily even responding to her as Jen, but only to her as She-Hulk. Life would be so much easier if I was just Jen. I think you're in a unique position to do some real good. Well, our writer's room was majority women. And so having so many different women um, all share their life experiences and sharing the kind of issues that they deal with, stories from their past they've experienced, like all of that brings this totality of the woman experience. It's funny because that walking in the dark alley and then having that moment of realization where you can switch. Oh, wait. Get off me. <laughs> that was one of the core scenes for me. We wanted this to be super specific. We're definitely not saying anything broad about everybody, but I think people will relate to it and feel it and be shocked by certain things and be upset by certain things and then also be relieved by Jen grabbing a hold of her story and saying like, no, I'd rather do this actually. It's these conversations, you know, the conversations between the writers and Tatiana and we and the men were included in them too, Kevin and Brad and, you know, all the creative males behind it. But just having those female voices to kind of go, this is what my experience is. I love it. It makes me so happy. It's what I want to see in the MCU and to be able to do it is an honor and, and a pleasure. The message we're sending is that if you attack, harm or harass innocent people, I'm coming for you. Do you mean in the courtroom or as a superhero? Oh. Now tell our viewers, who are you wearing to court today? Okay. <laughs>